Hey YouTube, this is Such Root Doss, and this is my first template that's going to be from A20 Productions. So this template, I, I like to call it Green Flourish, but you can call it whatever you want. So um, right now I'm just going to be showing you how to um, be using this template. So basically what you do, you, um, it's a zip file, you just have to download it from either your Mega Upload or Mediafire. You just double click on it depends on just whatever you have to do to unzip it and then um, basically you'll just be left with a project file and a folder that says evolution but it's actually not you just have to double click on the project file just watch it open up okay so now you have it open everything is in order okay and if you play, it'll just render. It's but it's exactly what you just saw right now. Okay, so now I'm just gonna be showing you how to um, just change the color of the um, objects and the text. So if you want to just change the text color, all you have to do is just click on this text object right here, and then you can just go ahead and change the color to whatever you want. Actually, sorry, you just have to. Actually, you have to click on the text object. So, you just go ahead and click on this text object. Go ahead and change the color to whatever you want. Let's try blue, just practically whatever you want. And then I'm just not going to do that right now. So, um, you all know how to change the text color. Um, just very basic. Now, if you want to change the, uh, the color of the objects, all you have to do is hit the down arrow right here. If you can't see that, it's just right there, there, right next to the object. You just hit that down arrow, hit the down arrow on layer styles, hit the down arrow on color overlay, and then from there you can change the color, its opacity, pretty much anything. So let me just give you a very quick demo of that. Okay, so we're just changing the opacity. That's changing the opacity of the color, by the way. So let's just make it red all of a sudden, bright red. Unfortunately, you're going to have to do this for every single layer. Well, actually, uh, a good way, if you want, is just to um, make all these layers into a pre-composition and then do it from there. Sorry about that. I was kind of in a rush. I didn't um, do this in a pre-composition. But it really takes no time, so just, um, you can go ahead and do that if you'd like. So basically that's it. It's just very basic. Everything's set up for you. So, um, that is all you have to do. And then you guys can use this template anywhere. Give us credit. And, um, just no selling this template. Like, it's, um, like, it's just, and, um, pizza.